cases, if you're trying to update and you leave OEM unlocked off the very first time under developer options, you may get this error message if OEM unlocking is off. Let's see, I need to enable it, but if it's off, you get this. So when you try to select it a few times, but on the bottom you'll see something like this. Nothing happens and you get this thing. Sorry you can't SD card update, upgrade. Sorry you can't SD card upgrade. And so. You need to go into develop options and set that setting for your ZT tablet. You just have to do it that one time and afterwards it works fine, I think. This is my ZTE K88. And if you have a ZT um, tablet or phone and you're trying to update it, one thing that you may come across is error messages uh, when trying to do the SD card update. You need to go into developer options and to do that you need to go into settings and about tablet so go into settings scroll to the very bottom and go about tablet and then under build number over here at the bottom click it a few times and then it'll open developer options it says it's already open because i did this already go back and then go into developer options you'll need to enable developer options over here and then go to sorry my phone's on the fritz OEM unlocking over here this needs to be turned on if it isn't I'm going to show you the area that you get when you try to boot into recovery so let me go do that okay first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to shut off my tablet This is assuming you've already inserted an SD card into your into your what do you call it ZT tablet. So I have the SD card already in here, as well as the update.zip file in there. And in, I need to go into recovery, volume up, power button. So I'll press power button, volume up together. The tricky part is if you let go of the power button, it's gonna go to boot. It's going to reboot your device. So this is what's happening for my ZT. I'm not sure if other ZT K8, non K8, 88, ZT Trek 2. Oh, see, it rebooted. So that's a real problem for me. Hold the power button, okay? So I'm going to hold my left hand power button. Once it go, boots into recovery, I'm going to press. I need to hold and press it and press the up button until I get to the. Oh my gosh, this is so frustrating. This is probably the hardest thing of doing the update is just getting into recovery mode. See, I'm just trying to get there. Anyways, let me get to that screen.
So it should boot into recovery. And remember, I, I left uh, the unlock setting to off. So now when I volume keys move the selection and power button runs it, selects it for you. So I'm going to press power button and it's working now. But it should give you an error message. For some reason it's working now. Go figure.